Hi, Career Sighted. I'm Corey Edwards, and I'm an animation writer-director. You can be just the writer. You can be just the director. It's a nice and rare thing when you get to be the writer and the director. You are the sole storyteller of the piece. For animation, that's great because all the questions funnel to me. Can we rewrite this scene? Can we add this character? Can we add this line? Those are all writer questions. And then what does this set look like? What's the scene feel like? What's the music going to be like? I'm taking all the meetings about all those topics. An animated film has a very long schedule, two to three years sometimes. I come into the production office about nine in the morning and have some conversations with my producer. Right now I'm dealing with concept artists and then I've got storyboard artists. And if you talk to me six months from now, I'll be coming in and I'll be looking at sequences. We'll work out what's called animatics or where the camera is. And so we'll start to deal with everything in a computer. And then if you talk to me six months after that, I'm looking at final color and I'm looking at rendered shots. You're kind of making the entire 90 minute movie over and over and over again. There is travel involved. On this particular film that I'm working on, I will have to go to India where the shop is. You need to have enthusiasm, you need to be energetic. You need to be able to inspire other people a lot of this job is just people management. Even in high school, you can get a hold of a camera. You probably have editing systems on your computer. You can start to get a crew of people together that on the weekends can go out and shoot something. A real turning point for me was that my art teacher, Mrs. Wilson, let me for a semester just make an animated film. That was my art class. I've had history projects where instead of turning in a report, they let me shoot a film. After high school, a lot of good can come out of going to a film school. I did not go to film school. I went to a liberal arts college. I took a variety of subjects. I did major in broadcast arts, and then I took an art minor. I'm a very visual filmmaker. Some filmmakers, they go up the writing ladder. I also took a lot of editing. My first jobs were in editing. I believe you should have a college education and that you should study architecture and history and literature, not just film classes, not just writing classes. You can't just go make movies based on other movies you've seen. After college, you probably have to put in about 10 years of entry-level work. My graduate school was just going and getting a job on the set immediately. The sooner you can get into the workplace of film, the better. If you want to make movies, really make movies, you got to come to LA. You really do. Get here and learn how the business really works. The more you work in this business, you, you start to know yourself. You know what you're good at, you know what you're not good at. So, so just keep making stuff. The more you know yourself, the more confident you're going to be because ultimately a writer-director has to be confident in their vision. I constantly have to just take meetings and go into rooms with strangers and tell them what their movie should be. But I'm very fortunate to do a job that I've wanted to do since I was 10 years old. Don't forget the spark that you're feeling right now. Don't forget the reason why you're getting into this business. Thanks, Career Sighted.